Yeah, fantastic. Um, it's a big thing to, to be given that responsibility and I am grateful for that. Um, just wish that uh, over the last two games we could have done a bit better. I'd rather none of that and had two wins or a better result that, than we had on Tuesday. So um, it's been... It, it's been good, I've, but I haven't been able to enjoy it as much as I'd like to. Yeah, it just kind of takes the gloss off, I suppose. Yeah, definitely, it? and I'll, I'll always put the team before myself, so it's you can't really enjoy it, like I say, you can't really enjoy it as much as you'd like to, but it's been fantastic, and I'm grateful to be given that chance and proud to have that opportunity, so um, it's not something that I take lightly, so um, yeah, great. We've heard today about a, an ankle injury for Glenn, um, which means that he's going to miss possibly this game coming up and maybe mm. a few others as well. How does your role change when he's not in the team? When you are the captain, obviously there's a bit more responsibility, but is there anything else that is different when you're there? Do you maybe take on that bit of extra responsibility in organising things? Yeah, I think without, without um, Glenn, you're going to notice, um, notice the absence of him. Um, whether I'm captain or not, I try and pull my weight and try and uh, make myself heard and um, influence other people around me um, and try and lead by example with how I'm playing and how I'm training in the week and things like that. But um, you know, you're bound to notice when people like that leave the team. So it's up to me and it's up to others as well to to make sure that we um, sort of bridge that gap and. Uh, we, people have got to take responsibility whether it's with how they're playing or whether it's with their opening their mouth so um, yeah I, I'm, I've learnt a lot of Glenn so um, I'll just try and uh, hopefully slot in and not make, make it too much of a difference